Um, it's great. Um, I got Brisbane a couple of weeks ago, and that was a big, uh, big deal for me that I have um, at least something in the summer. But um, it's good. I think I had a pretty good playoff, um, considering you know I didn't play a match in over two months. Um, you know, it was a good, good practice run for me, um, and I'm very happy to have received the wildcard, of course. It's hard to say because I haven't been at my really best for a couple of years, so it's difficult to, you know, to explain. But um, um, you know, I think the most important thing is to work hard, to try to be as, uh, you know, in, in best physical shape as you can be. Um, that's what I'm working on. That's why I think last week was just good practice because I still think um, I could have played much, much better. So it's a good sign that I was getting through matches pretty easily. But um, now I just have to focus on the summer and, uh, you know, even no matter what happens after the summer, continue to play, you know, as many weeks as I can. And I think I'll improve with that a lot. Even this year I played, uh, you know, when they have points in maybe seven events and still it's uh, 1.30. So, of course, I think I have a lot of room for improvement. Yeah, I mean, obviously the draw will be very tough, um, except for Serena pulling out. But um, you got to go match by match. You never know what can happen. Um, you know, they, there's always been kind of underdogs that have come, especially early in the year, because everyone's still coming off their breaks and their off seasons. So yeah, but my goal is not just to do well in, in the Australian Open. It's you know the summer to to play well, um, to see where I am um, from maybe the top 20 and top 10 players and then to keep on working after that. Um, well, I know the tournaments that I'm playing, so that makes it a lot easier. You know, I have the two events before the Open, which is great, um, and, uh, and then the Open. So that's, you know, for sure three tournaments, three matches. Um, and um, I'm very happy to be starting in Brisbane. And, uh, you know, to know that I'm in the main draw of the Open, you know, is great. It makes things a lot easier. Yeah, I'm pumped. I uh, had a call from Todd Woolridge last night and felt like all my Christmases had come at once, um, knowing that you are know, playing the Aussie Open. I'm um, really looking forward to that. And we're out here on Margaret Court Arena at the moment and I've had some great memories from this court, so looking forward to getting back out here. I've played uh, maybe six or seven main draws, but every time, I think last night, me and my wife were high-fiving actually <laughs> when I found out the news, so it's pretty special. Um, you know, I told my parents as well, they were pumped for me, so I've got a lot of friends and family out here, so I can't wait to get out here. It's, it's huge, uh, especially if it's uh, pretty, pretty hot out here. Um, a lot of the guys are coming from the winter, coming from the US or from um, from Europe, so it's nice to get a nice hot day, especially with a big, big crowd behind you. Um, it can definitely play a massive role. Um, I know coming out to this court a couple of times, I uh, have had the national anthem and walked to Matilda, people were singing and carrying on. So, you know, as soon as I walked out, you had adrenaline, and you're not going to leave, you know, going to leave everything out here on the court when you have that sort of, you know, support behind you. No, it's nice knowing that my summer's set, I can play Brisbane, I can play Sydney, then um, hopefully get a few wins under my belt and have a bit of confidence coming to the Australian Open. Um, yeah, a few little things. Um, towards the back end of my uh, year, I didn't have too many wins, so the confidence was a little bit down, but winning three matches and getting better every match and getting close to beating Marinko in five, you know, it's giving me a bit, of, a bit more confidence. But I think you just got to work on a bit of transition, uh, getting into the net maybe a little bit more. Um, missed a couple of volleys, so probably a bit more volley work and the serve can always improve, um, but that's more of a rhythm thing, I guess.